Hi everyone! So this is my first ever YouTube video, um, as you can probably tell I am a little bit nervous but for today's video I'm going to be doing a little Q&A, a little get to know me just to let you guys know, uh, my hair is not normally greeny blue I did that whole trend going around at the moment tried to dye my hair blue and it kind of turned green so we'll leave that out please if you do enjoy the video please give it a like subscribe the usual please follow my socials my instagram my tiktok stuff like that will be here and also in the description i will be looking over here quite a lot uh, this is where i've put the questions that you guys have left me over on my instagram so if you guys want to be included in another video maybe in the future be sure to follow my instagram so without further ado let's jump straight into the questions curious butterflies you mean bread and butterflies oh yes of course So the first question that I got asked is what's your YouTube channel going to be about? Now I'm very into uh, music, fashion, beauty, stuff like that but I'm also a very, I'd like to say a bubbly person so I think maybe in the future uh, challenges, stuff like that. My sister's very into comedic things so maybe it'll be fun to do a video with her I think that'll be quite funny um but just generally to have a good time really the second question is what inspires you um now this one's kind of hard um I don't really know what inspires me but to try and kind of change the question a little bit the people who inspire me um I'd like to say is my family they've been there for me like through everything i'm so grateful for them they're literally the best family in the world so supportive like oh my god love them to bits i would also have to say um my best friend Gemma. you're probably gonna be watching this but probably gonna be the first person watching this um but again she's been there for me through everything and i love her so much yeah i'd have to say my family and my friends obviously i've got like idols and stuff so Ariana Grande, enough said really, uh, love that girl so much. Halsey, love Halsey, I've seen her twice and she is by far up there with one of my favourite people I've ever seen. So amazing, I love her mentality, she's so like body positive, feminist, you know, all about sticking up for rights and what she believes in, I just think that's so cool. So the next question is dream car. If you know me, uh, you know I love Audis. They are my favourite car. I've always tried to persuade my dad to get an Audi as a family car. He finally did it this year. Um, but obviously I'm growing up now and don't really need to be in the family car quite a lot. So, but yeah, I love Audis. I would have to say I've an Audi A1, obviously, Audi TT, Audi R8, Audi TT, a lot of people make fun of me because they say it's a hairdresser's car. I think Audi R8s are sexy as hell. Seven, um, especially a sports back, that sexy car again, um, but has to be in white. I love white Audis, like it can't be any other colour apart from baby blue. I saw a baby blue one the other day and I asked my dad if he could buy one for me and he said no. Anyway, moving on. How many siblings do you have? Um, I've got one, one crazy sister. She's 22, she's older than me. We kind of look alike. A lot of people like who haven't seen us in a long time, like family, friends, always be like, oh, how's the hairdressing going? And I'm like, I work in a hotel. <laughs> um, but yeah, she's, Again, like I said before, one of the most amazing people. I'm so glad that I have her. Um, so grateful. I don't. Li I literally don't know what I'd do without her. She's the best thing. Like she's literally one of my best friends. I don't know what I'd do. The next question is, what's your makeup routine? Um, so my makeup routine. Uh, if you guys would like to see a separate video of this, uh, be sure to let me know because I I would be down for this. Um, I love my makeup. Um just i've always had like a little thing for makeup i'm not like amazing at it so i've never like thought to be like a makeup artist or something i'm not that great honestly but 
yeah if you guys would like to see a makeup routine let me know and i'll definitely do that for you um i don't really know how to describe my makeup routine in here in a really short video um i'm not like i said i'm not very good at makeup i've got makeup on today but my favorite brand of makeup um is probably jeffree star love jeffree star and then I would probably have to say Too Faced. I love the Too Faced foundation. Uh, I think it's called Born This Way. Love that foundation. Um, and I also love the liquid lipsticks as well. But yeah, Too Faced, amazing. Um, so yeah. What is your dream career? Um, so I've always, well, a little backstory here in year nine, um, you know, I had to pick my GCSE options and I just sat down with my mum and I was like, help. I don't know what I want to do with my life. Um, I haven't really got it sorted. She was like, don't think about a career. What do you want to achieve in life? And if you guys are going through like year nine as well and you're a bit stuck on what to do, think like this. Don't think of a career. Think of what you want to do in life and what do you want to achieve. So I said I want to travel, I want to explore the world, uh, I would like to say I'm a very adventurous person and she just straight up went go into the travel industry then. So right now I'm working in a business hotel that is owned by an airport, I'm already in the travel industry and I would love to do cabin crew um, but I feel like at the moment I'm only 18 so I am a little bit too young so I'd like to carry on working where I am at the moment and then develop on to be cabin crew i think that would be amazing travel of the world would just be the dream whilst working like win-win really isn't it the next question is what is your favorite food um my favorite favorite food is pizza freaking love pizza this might spark a bit of a debate but pineapple does not belong on pizza okay i said it i said it it doesn't i'm sorry but yeah pizza is my favorite food um my favorite restaurant to go to is probably either nando's or zizi's with my boyfriend we go on date nights it's always at zizi's love it cheap good food what else do you want so the next question um is what is your favorite ariana grande song now Again, if you know me, if you follow me on Instagram, you probably know that I love Ariana Grande. She is my favourite singer. She has been for years. I've liked her ever since Victorious and Sam and Cat. Love the woman. I was meant to go see her in 2017 for her Dangerous Woman tour, but obviously for the circumstances, it got cancelled uh, in London. So um, I then finally got to see her last year on her Sweetener tour. On the 19th of August and I had sound check VIP I was in the pit and the best night of my life basically I spent loads of people are a bit like you spent way too much money even my mum um but best experience and I would do it again so um yeah a little backstory I love Ariana Grande but my favorite Ariana Grande song is probably either I there's quite a lot because she's got so many albums I'm a bit like hard to choose from but I love from her newest albums um Good Night and Go um Every Time Bad Idea Bloodline God is a Woman you know Empowerment the list is endless so they're just a few of my favourites, a few. The next question is, where do you want to go in life? So this one, I kind of feel like it relates to like, what's your dream career and um, stuff like that. Just to make people happy. Like obviously doing the cabin crew things, you wanna, if they're going on holiday, you wanna make sure that people are like buzzed to go on their holiday. They've started the holiday good. Just wanna make people happy. Um, and again, where I'm working right now, I work in a hotel and I work in the restaurant area. Red Star Standards. Um, so it's nice to please people and make sure they have a really good experience with us. Um, so I just, where do you want to go in life, really? I just I just want to make people happy, make them smile. I'm, I'm kind of a people pleaser, the same with my sister. Uh, so, yeah. Also, I would really like to have a family have children and watch them grow up 
and just live a happy life. Probably not stay in the area that I'm currently in. Hopefully in the next year or two I'll be moving in with my boyfriend which is really exciting. Makes me feel like a proper grown up. Um, so yeah. And then the last question uh, of this video is what made you start YouTube? I feel like this is a very good question. Ever since I was younger, I always, always watched YouTube videos. I went to Summer in the City, Soccer Six, things like that, where all these these YouTubers used to go do meetups. You could meet all your favourite YouTubers. I've just always watched YouTube and I've always had those people who I watch and I'm like, that would be so cool to do. I've never really had the balls to do it. Um, and then recently, uh, some people that I do know have started their own YouTube channel and it's kind of given me that push. There's this one girl who I used to go to school with. Her name's Ellie as well, convenient. Um, but she just started her own YouTube channel and I've been watching her recently and she's doing really well. And I just, it kind of gave me that push to say, you can do it. Don't be afraid of what people say. That's what my main concern was was back in school and back in college I used to be scared of people making fun of me and just not being very nice about it but now that I'm older I'm not in school I'm not in college I kind of have that do you know what I don't care what you say about me attitude you know so yeah I'm kind of giving it a shot uh, this is not like a job thing I'm just doing this for my own purpose to make me have a little bit of a hobby yeah I just think it's quite a cool idea um, always been into stuff like this, uh, always, always watched YouTube. So yeah, I think I'm going to end this video here. Please, again, if you did enjoy, please leave a like down below and comment what videos you would like me to do in the future. I will leave my Instagram, TikTok and all my socials in the description and at the end of this video. I hope you enjoyed and I will see you in the next one, hopefully. Bye. Thank you.